Explain better, Katie. What up? Uh, today we're going to do the localizer DME approach to runway zero eight at Innsbruck. And now uh, I've got a chart up here, which is the visual approach procedure. Um, don't really need the other chart, but what you do really need to know is that you need to be at Ratzenberg or RTT. NDB at 9,500 feet, and you leave Ratzenberg on a heading of 210 degrees until we get to 255 radial on 111.1, which means we pick up Absam at um, approximately 5,000 feet. So you leave Ratzenberg at 9,500 feet, descending to 5,000 feet to be at 5,000 feet or above by uh, AB Absam 313. At this point, you should be looking for the runway. You should be able to see the runway, runway because this is a complete visual approach. It's nothing else is a visual approach to runway 08. Once you get to AB, turn left on a heading of 230 degrees, okay, descending from 5,000 feet to 3,700 feet by the Innsbruck NDB, which is uh, 264 degrees, right? Once you get to the Innsbruck NDB, you turn right on a heading of 264 degrees, continuing your descent down to 3,700 feet, and you turn at approximately three and a half miles DME onto final for the runway. So you need to be keeping a lookout to the right-hand side for the runway. As I say, it's a visual approach at 3,700 feet, uh, approximately three and a half miles DME, turn right and roll out onto final approach for runway 08. Now in practice this is what it looks like. So I've come off I've come off A B and I'm hopefully on that heading. I know that I was slightly off the heading here, but I had visual with the runway. We can see it behind me so I, I, I was visual all the way down here. And you need to be bleeding speed off. Now, recommendations, especially in the 737, is that you really should be full flap at this particular point. I wasn't full flap, which was maybe a little bit of a mistake, but I started my right-hand turn. Uh, it looks as though I'm climbing, but that's just the angle of the camera as we turn here for uh, our approach. Um, keep turning. It's a rate one turn, 30 degree of bank and all the time making sure you slow down. If you're full flap, gears down, you'll be really dirty, and you need this because it is a short approach. It's an extremely short approach, around about three three miles when you make that final turn, as you'll see in a moment. Uh, there we are just turning in the valley, plenty of clearance, uh, no, no danger of hitting anything. Uh, as we come around for our final approach into Innsbruck, runway 08, I was a little bit high, as you can see, only a little bit, but it is a steep descent anyway from 3,000 feet down to uh, the runway. Uh, runway elevation, I believe, is around about 1,500 feet, so you're only dropping 1,500 feet, but you do it very, very quickly. Uh, and I was able to get flap out, uh, full flap, and bleed off speed. And so here we come, runway 08. Uh, not far to go now and it's a total visual approach you cannot do this in bad weather it is a visual approach from uh, Ratzenberg at 9,500 feet descending to 3,700 as you make that turn uh, you've got to look at the charts follow the charts and you can't go far, far wrong 